Hey kids, it's Deputy Mike Staley with the next episode of Hook'em and Book'em. Today I'll be reading Owen by Kevin Hinks. Owen had a fuzzy yellow blanket. He had it since he was a baby. He loved it with all his heart. Fuzzy goes where I go, said Owen, and Fuzzy did. Upstairs, downstairs, in between, inside, outside, upside down. Fuzzy likes what I like, said Owen, and Fuzzy did. Orange juice, grape juice, chocolate milk, ice cream, peanut butter, applesauce, cake. Isn't he getting a little old to be carrying that thing around, asked Miss Tweezers. Haven't you heard of the blanket fairy? Owen's parents hadn't. Miss Tweezers filled them in. That night, Owen's parents told Owen to put Fuzzy under his pillow. In the morning, Fuzzy would be gone, but the blanket fairy would leave him an absolutely wonderful, positively perfect, especially terrific, big boy gift in his place. Owen stuffed Fuzzy inside his pajama pants and went to sleep. No blanket fairy, said Owen in the morning. No kidding, said Owen's mother. No wonder, said Owen's father. Fuzzy's dirty, said Owen's mother. Fuzzy's torn, ratty, said Owen's father. No, said Owen. Fuzzy is perfect, and Fuzzy was. Fuzzy played Captain Plunger with Owen. Fuzzy helped Owen become invisible. And Fuzzy was essential when it came to nail clippings and haircuts and trips to the dentist. Can't be a baby forever, said Miss Tweezers. Haven't you heard of the vinegar trick? Owen's parents hadn't. Miss Tweezers filled them in. When Owen wasn't looking, his father dipped Owen's favorite corner of Fuzzy into a jar of vinegar. Owen sniffed it and smelled it and sniffed it. He picked a new favorite corner. Then he rubbed the smelly corner all around his sandbox, buried it in the garden, and dug it up again. Good as new, said Owen. Fuzzy wasn't very fuzzy anymore but Owen didn't care. He carried it and wore it and dragged it. He kissed it and hugged it and twisted it. What are we going to do, asked Owen's mother. School is starting soon, said Owen's father. Can't bring a blanket to school, said Miss Tweezers. Haven't you heard of saying no? Owen's parents hadn't, Miss Tweezers filled them in. I have to bring Fuzzy to school, said Owen. No, said Owen's mother. No, said Owen's father. Owen buried his face in Fuzzy. He started to cry and would not stop. Don't worry, said Owen's mother. It'll be all right, said Owen's father. And then suddenly, Owen's mother said, I have an idea. It was an absolutely wonderful, positively perfect, especially terrific idea. First she snipped, and then she sewed. Then she snipped again, and sewed some more. <clears throat> snip, 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 sew, 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 dry your eyes, wipe your nose, hooray, hooray, hooray. Now Owen carries one of his not-so-fuzzy handkerchiefs with him wherever he goes. And Miss Tweezers doesn't say a thing. The end.